Hi, welcome to On This Day in Tudor History with me, Claire Ridgway, author of On This Day in Tudor History. Now today I'm taking you back to King Henry VIII's reign, but on this day in Tudor history, the 15th of May, 1537, Thomas Darcy, 1st Baron Darcy de Darcy, and his cousin John Hussey, 1st Baron Hussey of Sleaford, were tried for treason at Westminster after being implicated in the pilgrimage of Grace Rebellion. If you listen to my 20th of October talk on the surrender of Pontefract Castle, you'll know that on that day in 1536, Lord Darcy had yielded his castle to the rebels of the Pilgrimage of Grace after they'd threatened an assault on the castle. No violence was necessary, and it's thought that Darcy was sympathetic to the rebel cause anyway, because of his reservations about the dissolution of the monasteries and the power of Thomas Cromwell. John Hussey, 1st Baron Hussey of Sleaford, Lincolnshire, and Chief Butler of England, was a staunch Catholic and a supporter of the Princess Mary. But when rebellion had broken out in his county in late 1536, he told the rebels to walk home knaves for the king is used not to condition with no such rebellious and that he refused to betray his king by joining them. He even fled disguised as a priest to try and stop the rebels taking him. However, his faith, his support for Princess Mary and what was seen as his inaction against the rebels in his area led to him being implicated in the rebellion and accused of conspiring and rebelling against the king. Darcy and Hussey were tried on this day in 1537 by a jury of their peers, preceded over by the Marquis of Exeter as High Steward of England. A record in the letters and papers of Henry VIII's reign shows that both men pleaded not guilty, but that they were both found guilty of high treason. The sentence was, judgment as usual in cases of high treason, execution to be at Tyburn, i.e. they were sentenced to the full traitor's death to be hanged, drawn and quartered at Tyburn. However, their sentences were commuted to beheading due to their status as barons. It was decided that Hussey would be executed in his home county of Lincolnshire, so he was escorted to Huntingdon by Sir Thomas Wentworth, who then handed him over to Sir William Parr, who took him to Lincoln and handed him over to Charles Brandon, Duke of Suffolk. Hussey was beheaded in Lincoln on the 29th of June 1537. Darcy was beheaded on Tower Hill in London the following day, the 30th of June 1537. I'll give you links in the video description to further videos on the Pilgrimage of Grace Rebellion. Also on this day in Tudor history, the 15th of May 1567, the recently widowed Mary Queen of Scots married for the third time, taking James Hepburn, Earl of Bothwell and Duke of Orkney as her husband. And you can find out more in last year's video, which you'll find a link to in the video description. And on this day in 1536, Queen Anne Boleyn and her brother George Boleyn, Lord Rochford, were tried by a jury of their peers, presided over by their own uncle, the Duke of Norfolk. Did they have any hope of justice? What happened? What do the contemporary sources tell us? And what happened when George Boleyn disobeyed an order? Well, you can find out in the 15th of May, 1536 video, which I'll give you a link to too. You can subscribe to the channel by clicking that button there. And I do ask you to do so, that would be so good, thank you. And you can give me a like and leave a comment and you can hit the bell to be notified as these videos go live so you don't miss out on one. But I'll be back tomorrow, see you then. Bye-bye.